Today we're here with the Samantha Smith Challenge at Thomas College where nearly 300 middle and high school students and nine different schools from Maine and across the country are participating in our what we call the Samantha Smith Challenge for Americans Who Tell the Truth. And they choose an issue that's important to them, they do some research, they connect with community stakeholders, and then they use the power of art to bring attention and awareness to what they're doing. And it's been really exciting today to see the commitment and the curiosity and the engaged citizenship that these students have shown. The kids are just glowing and so proud of their work and able to just articulate themselves and it's like they've earned the success. And I think, you know, that's something that a lot of schoolwork doesn't offer. It doesn't have that high stake, real audience kind of a thing. And it's probably some of the best stuff that they've created in their entire academic career so far. You could do like any problem. Like it's such a good way to bring awareness to every issue around the world. And it's so worth it in the, in the end. It definitely helped me realize this problem and all my other classmates. And it, it made me realize that like these things are out there. My project is about police brutality. I, when looking through uh, Mr. Shetterly's works, there were lots of civil rights activists, but none that really specifically had their activism towards police brutality. So I wanted to change it up and be different in that way. I'm a biracial kid who's, my father's been pulled out of his car for just in regular traffic stops and put against his car just because he gave blip. So this is, th these are the type of things that, uh, that really impact me hard. And I've had plenty of instances in, this, in these cases with many of my family members, so it was just something that was very powerful. So I have a student who is very, very shy, very quiet. She doesn't speak in class and she created an art piece that is so amazing about her disability and she was able to join us in a Zoom interview. We interviewed Bill Bigelow, and she was so nervous to even ask a question over Zoom, and she was able to do that. And her piece and her artist statement are out of this world fantastic. <laughs> She's one of the students who is able to shine, who you know oftentimes might struggle in a regular academic setting and she just knocked it out of the park with the Samantha Smith challenge. <laughs> so you as young people, as students, become the teachers. And one of the responsibilities of having the knowledge you have now is to be that teacher, is to make sure that when you sing, when you tell your story, when you talk about your issue, that it does carry far. Or that your young voices, with the knowledge you've got, carry these messages, and you can really make a difference by doing that. So I want to just thank you so much for participating in this and that the amount of energy and the quality of the work you did. It's truly inspiring, and I hope to see a lot of you again. Thank you very much.